big through the jeweler's loop and off the grid. So let's get going. First thing we're going to do is talk about materials. Watercolor paper is essential for this project, and there are many different varieties. There's hot press, which has a smooth surface. There's cold press, which has a tooth or a um, raised surface. And rough, which is, has an even bigger or stronger tooth. I prefer cold press. Today, I'm going to use um, a watercolor block. Now, the important thing about watercolor is the poundage of the paper. You have 90 pound paper, 140 pound paper, and 300 pound paper. 140 pound paper is the minimum that you want to use because otherwise the water will warp the paper. 